right, now I'm going to show you how to resize a pattern. Uh, every PC comes with MS Paint, so what you want to do is just load that, open it up, and then go up under File and hit Open, locate the file that you want to change. In this particular case, we're going to go with this ginseng pattern. And what you'll see here by going up to Image Attributes, that this is actually 8.16 inches high and 5.6 inches wide. Make sure inches are checked, not pixels, because inches are what are going to be the real world usage of this. So you go, okay, well I want this to be 5 inches, not 8 inches. So if you pick 5 and you just click it like that and hit OK, what's happened, you'll see it has cut off the bottom because you've told the canvas to be 5 inches tall, not the image. So it has clipped the image. Obviously not what we want to do. So we hit Control Z and then we go back over here and hit attributes and we say okay this is eight inches fine I want to make it five so we have to find resize and skew or skew and you'll see this it does it by percentage well how do you figure out what the percentage is there really is no other way to do it so what you want to do is go back to your attributes you'll see you just move it off to the side there open up the calculator that comes with every PC and you'll see that this is uh, now zeroed out, and we say, okay, we want it to be 5, so we type in 5, and then we're going to go divided by, that's what that forward slash means, and then you put in 8.16, hit the equal button, and you'll see this actually means it's 61.27% of the size, forget all these other numbers, and we're actually going to round that to be just 61% because we really don't need to get it exact. So we know at 61%, we can do this, so then we can close this here. We now go back up to resize or skew and type in 61%. Now what, what happens if you just do the horizontal? You click that and see what happens? It squished it. It basically said, okay, I'm just gonna change this horizontally, but not vertically, and that doesn't work. So we undo that, go back up to resize skew, and go 61% and 61% for the vertical, hit OK, and you'll see, there you go, perfectly proportioned, and you can verify the size. You just go to Attributes, and now it says 4.98, so you're up two one-hundredths of an inch off, which is not bad, especially since it's smaller, and you're four one-hundredths of an inch off on the width. That really is such a small amount that it shouldn't make any difference whatsoever. So you just hit OK. You can then go up to your file, save as and in this case I'm gonna call this ginseng 5.0 so I know that this is five inches that's just the way I'll remember it and hit save to my desktop and there you have it you have a, a perfectly proportioned perfectly sized resizing